We back here. We back. You better remember us when you're famous. Fame ain't gonna change me, bro. I'm the same dude at the end of the day. <laughs> don't worry. I don't think I'm gonna change all that much. And we still have so much work to do. Like, we have to put up all these posters so people will actually show up and cheer for us. Oh, brother! Do you think all this get it energy is tied to the meteor? The power of stardust. You what know? do you mean? Sometimes all you need is a push. Like today, I drew the Eight of Wands. Who? This is a higher power saying, like, move it, girl! I was about to pass your ass, let's go! You know, bro, when, you, when you're about to get your blown to hell, you, you ready to do anything, bro. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. I, I feel like I'm finally on my way to something. I really believe that the cards just help us get clarity. It's not about the future so much as tuning into where you are right now. And what energy you can work with, and what energy you can send right to the trash. See ya. No thanks. You want to draw one? Um, yeah, I guess. Why not? Right? Think of a question. One of these three cards holds the answer. Or something like that. Right is always right. The, the Ooh, is always <laughs> Love to see this little guy. Any immediate feelings? So, this means the universe has my back, right? Mm, sorry to butt in, but we gotta run. School and all. Bro. <sighs> right. Listen, find me later if you want. I can explain it a bit. Hey, what the Catch you later, shooting rock star. Say, Joe Bama. That car could have could have been do or die. And all that stuff about the asteroid. If there are signs from the universe, a giant rock from space is a pretty shitty one. I, I can't let that be it. Don't carve our own path, bro. <sighs> Snap out of it, dork. Sorry if I'm not talking a lot, bro. I'm, I'm kind of eating some cereal right now. You know, it's like 8 in the morning, bro. Your nigga hungry as hell. A big nigga's got a... It's close to the deadline for college applications, so if you've been procrastinating, consider your final snooze button pressed. Now, Naomi has generously offered to help anyone who may be struggling. I can help with essays or proofreading. Whatever you need. Any questions? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need a little Big bit of time. Yeah, so... <laughs> uh, why are we even doing this? Well, you might not care, but many of your classmates are looking to their future. Sorry, really, but what future? Mm. I hate to break it to you, but this... seems like a waste of time. I mean, the future we're looking at's got a big rock blasting through it. Mm. No, the future is what we make it. I've worked really hard to get the life I want, and I'm not gonna let a big jerk rock ruin that. What do you say? My nigga, what are you finna do in this situation to get that damn rock hit you, bro? It's raps like, <laughs> like I'm sorry, bro, but that nigga Reed got it, bro. That nigga Reed got it. He's right, bro. If that, if he's the way it's looking right now. Are we just gonna ignore it? I guess I just don't see how anybody could ignore this. Well, since you insist on the subject. Presently, talk to these niggas, bro. We are within the early detection period. As time goes on, it may appear that the probability of a collision increases. However, this is to be expected as more precision shrinks the field of probability. Ultimately, we can expect the probability of impact to go down over time. Statistically speaking, if it did impact the planet, it would most likely be on a sparsely populated area or the ocean. There will always be a reason to avoid difficult tasks. I advise you to desensitize yourself to it. Mm -hmm. You'll never leave this classroom. Whatever. Primarily how you intend to excel under these unprecedented you know? circumstances. Perhaps the subject is not entirely irrelevant. It would stand you in good stead to reference the current events in your application letters. Nigga, read pass the notes like we don't sit directly next to each other. Nigga, stupid. 
Hey gang, hey gangy, it's Fang. Sorry. Also, their character name is Faye. Welcome, Faye. So, glad you're joining. Guys, we're in class right now, but yay, Fang, Faye. Dude, finally, you should dump all your stats into charisma. Do not dump all your stats into charisma. Coward. What's your weapon preference, though? Mine's a bat. Okay, can I just go bare hands? I'm trying to box. Man. Like baseball bat, not the animal. Although, that would be great. All right, all right, we get it, bro. Bro, come on, now. Reed, I need a bat sidekick, bro. Bro, I hear, I don't know, I ain't even gonna lie, I didn't forgot her name. <laughs> I didn't forgot names, bro. I didn't forgot names. So, like I said, your Mega Zostradon did not eat your homework. Who? The like, asteroid who the what? does not excuse you from planning your future. Yo? I'm gonna hit the vending machines. See you practice, Dark Mage. Dark Mage. Don't worry about LNL. Reed is a really great DM, and and you're a natural performer. Um, I'm sure you'll be great. God damn, get off that nigga dick, bro! Hey, can you back the hell up? Oh yeah, damn, she all over my damn face. I'm sure you'll be great. Uh, <laughs> I bro, back up. Really looking forward to it. Uh, thanks, bro. Yep. Yeah, and me too. Well, this is, um, I gotta. Hey, Sid, wild rumor going around that you put up the band posters? Gossip, right? Anyways, did you? I mean, nigga, yes? Well, yeah, I mean, yeah, bro, I put them, I put them up, because that, bro, that's, that was me. Yeah, sick, right? Gonna be there? Dickhead, bro. If I had wings, bro, I'm flying through the halls. <laughs> yeah, I never thought I'd see LJ look at us like... <laughs> like she didn't want to squish us out of existence? Seriously, dude. Trish, Amazing. that's her name. Who put up the poster outside? I need to be more outside. consistent, bro. Yo. Nice. God, I can't wait to destroy swamp babies. <laughs> Who's feeling smug in their leather pants now? More like bog olds. That shit was ass, Reed. Damn. You need to. You should have left that one in the draft. You got to be honest with this nigga. That shit was garbage. Oof. Wow, buddy. Now I'll workshop it. Please. Yeah, I want to see that baby shit was tears. Ass. What? I mean, not like that. Like the band crying. We'll workshop it. So how does this battle thing work anyway? LJ just picks whoever she likes most? Because she personally texts you, so. Um, kind of. But it, it's not just that. Or even who has the best songs. It's also who the audience liked the most. And not just liked, but who they connected with. You know? Yeah. Because, like, man, you spend a load of bullshit. And whoever LJ can get people to come see. Yeah, that's why the posters are so important. If we don't have anyone there for us, we're not gonna have an audience to connect with. Okay, no problem. We could win this thing right now. Not really. I mean, we hate swamp babies. Wetland grannies. But everyone else pretty much loves them. Wetland so we grannies, okay. Sniggery is goofy. Like what LJ was asking for originally. I, I have some ideas, Wait, we're not just doing the songs we just did that, you know, one? No, we can't. Come on, bro. I wish, bro. I mean, that would definitely in. be easier, but she said new songs. We got lucky just reworking the old stuff for the audition. Plus, we have a big chance now. We've got to use it to let people see the real worm drama. You mean us yeah but like the us we're gonna be when we're out on tour you know not just high school kids so did you put up the rest of the posters because i can print more i only took that one to school figured we'd have it covered Thank you, stupid. but i gave the rest to orson to put up on his delivery route smart oh no oh, i forgot to take him out of my bag dude i'm so sorry 
Trish, you need to lock so, the skin. Just put them up now. So they are thoroughly slime. Bro, leave that fucking. Don't. I could blow up. you like, slime, nigga. What are you doing? Bro, Trish, lock in, bro. We need to get people to come. Hey, yo. What? Whoa. 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 Okay, so I brought Mango to school again because I think she might have separation anxiety. My dad told me she makes like a whimpering sound when I'm gone and that made my heart explode. Anyway, she just sleeps in here all day anyway, so no one even knows. But she kind of sometimes sleeps slimes. Like most of the time. Like all the time. Cool. That's very gross. So I was gonna put posters in my locker. Bug at home. Mango? Wait. Mango? She's not here! Oh my god, she got out! Oh, uh oh. Okay, okay. Um, when did you last see her feel her in there? I don't know. Lunch, I guess? I hope that mouth get that. That was over an hour ago. <laughs> I'm sorry. She could be anywhere. I have to find her. It's okay. We're gonna help you look. But Right, Fang? Bro, I can't totally. be a dickhead, bro. Practice canceled. This damn dusty worm. ass worm, bro. God okay. damn. First, we need to triangulate and we need bait. Here are some moss biscuits that Rosa made for her. Mango loves them. This damn ugly ass goddamn. We're gonna find her. It's gonna be okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Ugly ad worm, bro. <sighs> worm hunt commence. Wait. Do I smell slime? Check outside. Okay, I only got one option, so. Of course I've seen a mango. Seen all kinds of fruits, man. Oh, a worm? Why is she talking Ain't like she got skin? Worms were a thing. I'll keep an eye out next bro. time I'm in the grocery store, though. Can you speed this up? I want some. Oh, a worm? I haven't seen a worm. Like, bro, if you don't lie, bro, why are you over here talking in slow motion? Put that shit up to two times speed and get the conversation over with. Have I seen a worm? Have I seen a worm? Did you see my shirt? Damn, that worm just up. Down the hall. I have to go change. Hey, bro. You you definitely got caught lacking, bro. Because how did you let that worm get up on you like that? Come on now, come on now. No. You're in the trash, aren't you? You're gonna make me dig through trash. Okay, okay. If I get slimed. I'm slamming this worm go. on the ground. Hell. Yeah. Bro. Damn. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, bro. I'm gonna kill your worm. Age of Swords. I don't know what that means. Oh, that's the damn number. All your posters around school today. Congrats on the gig. Are you excited? What is this? Yes. They're slow with the band right now. Wait, are you coming to the show? Who are who is this? <clears throat> going on with the band that's what i'm trying to figure out to be chris doesn't seem as excited about battle of the bands as i thought she would be even though it's been our dream since we were 13 and she doesn't have the time to learn new songs but i can't seem to write them anyway so I'm pretty stuck right now sorry for feelings about me yeah, sorry for for trauma dumping What's ahead of you can't beat what's inside of you. Look, look the future 
look the future in the face and your courage will spread like fire bro who is this and why are we texting him like we like we've been long like 16 like like long long fucking friends or whatever are you like a motivational speaker nah lol no it's from a show pretty heroes cartoon my god i loved that when i was younger oh i still love it such a nerd but it's really sweet but the messages are so cheesy they always inspire I don't know. Totally. I don't know what the f you're talking about. Is this like fucking Powerpuff Girls? Well, I bet your song is way better than you think. I really want to hear it. Pretty Heroes. Hmm. We're going to name the song Pretty Heroes. We won't stand around and let the world go. When the fire falls from a, from on high. And when the end of times crystallize. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Hold on. We won't sit we won't sit around and let the world go by. Did I start recording my, my face cam? Hold on, bro, because I could have been I, I might be slacking here. Hold on, let me check. We peep game, we peep game, we peep game, because if I if I'm folding, I'm mad. Okay, no, 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 we're good, we're good. Um, we won't back down. Fear in our eyes. We won't back down. Fear in our eyes. It is trash, no sir. We're gonna take a breath. Hold our heads, uh, our head up high. We're gonna take a breath. Hold our head up high. You hear that? How she said. We won't sit around. Let the world go by. Hmm. Okay. We won't sit around. Let the world go by. And when the fire falls from on high. And in the and in the love we have internalized. And when the end of times crystallize, and then the fire falls from on high. Mm. Okay, hello. And then the love we have internalized. Why, man? Is this it? Gotta go. I know, right? We won't sit around let the world go by. And then the love we have internalized. And then the fire falls from on high. I like that one a lot. When the fight, you know they. Who are you? Exactly, that's what I mean. Y'all, you were just texting, bro. Like y'all were his best friends. You totally just helped me write some lyrics. Who are you? Nah, I mean, should we? I'm not gonna sit up here and play along with the "You're the best, bro." Who are? Who is this person? Soon. I think. Maybe I'll come to the show. And I'm really glad I started talking to you, lol. Me too. I'm not sitting, bro. Who is this? Who is this? Why are we over here talking hey, like we've hi. been Hello. friends for 18 years? Bro. Look what I found. Oh, hey, they turned out pretty good, huh? Almost makes me wish mom and dad were back to see me actually succeeding at music. Imagine that. You're not getting it. Probably because you completely ignored my texts today, but I didn't ignore it took your me text. forever to pull them all down. What? Yeah, nah. What the? F what the hell? I had to. Lava Java serves beer after five. You can't advertise that in a school, Fang. What? That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Who even cares? The principal, the school board, the school could get a huge fine. And I'm the student representative. Class president takes the blame. I don't give a fuck, bro. Hey, you're fucking tweaking. Come on. I don't believe that. No one cares that much. Except me, the real person in front of you. One I didn't person. make the rule, but I'm responsible for it. That's why I sent you like 10 texts that I'm sure are still unread. I could have helped you put stickers over the venue name or something. Why didn't Everyone you just do that? Everyone knows where it is anyway. Can't I have one thing, Nasser? Why do you have to ruin this for me? Exactly. Like, That's do you, what you think I'm trying to do? You're the one who locked yourself into mom and dad's little plan for you. I, sorry, I'm not doing presentations on, like, admissions essays or whatever. You guys can't stand to see me do what I want if it isn't go to college, get a job, 
Yeah, Tokyo. Well, this nigga, this nigga is tweaking. Like, why would you rip them all, like, you you rip them all down? You can do whatever and be happy. Yeah. Guess I wasn't chosen for greatness. You know, pause it real quick, bro, because this nigga just sat up here and straight up gave a solution to the problem, ignored his own solution, and took them all down instead, which would have taken far more time. He could have just went around the school with stickers and covered up the venue, and the problem would have been solved. Both parties would have been happy. This nigga directly chose to be a dickhead, and then is going to get mad at us. Like, what? Nah, bro. That's not what I meant. Nah, oh, that's yeah. what I meant. You don't get it, do you? I don't have it easy, Fang. I don't actually uh. just do whatever. I don't have that kind of freedom. And I do? I am sick of everyone treating me like some spoiled brat. Like I don't bust my ass. If I was studying every night to be a doctor or something... You'd be Naomi. Hey, right. Hey. And everyone would love me for it. I mean, at least they'd assume I was doing something valuable. And no one would think I had all this freedom. They'd just think I knew what I wanted and how to get it. Is that how Trish feels too? Feels like I haven't seen her around as much lately. What are you getting at? Hey, Our uh, drama this. is actually getting somewhere. Finally. And you're sure everyone's along for the same ride? What's the worst that could happen if you have a backup? Not starve? Make mom and dad a little bit happy? Because otherwise, what? You live here forever? You and me both, right? Or do you have big dreams? Hmm. I'm still figuring that out. So you don't have What's a plan, but you're going to critique B? my plan. This nigga's stupid. What's your plan A, now that you mention it? Mm. I don't know. So wait a... <laughs> Say that again, please. Is that what it, what this is about? Unacceptable answer. Say that again for you. I'm sorry. Did the student president just say he doesn't know what he wants? I'm not even graduating this year. Really? Nothing. I'm working on it. I I still have time. Cap. Oh come on. All you have to say is doctor or lawyer. I'll text it to mom and dad right now. I'm not just going to say something to make you happy. <laughs> Imagine that. Why are you even doing all these activities then? Just to be popular, just to follow the rules. Just so you won't be alone. I don't know, Baron. I'm going to be honest. None of these are what just I would have said. Just to get a gold star for doing what everyone else tells you to? <sighs> you shouldn't let mom and dad pressure you so much. Just do what you want. Yeah. Okay. I get it. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't beat on this nigga enough, I bro. promise it's not as scary as it seems. Fake ass Chris Brown. Ha <laughs> 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 Faye, my dark mage. How fare you this fine eve? What is this nigga talking about? A nigga what? <laughs> what? Welcome, Faye. Always room for more magic. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Okay, out of character. I'm really glad you're here. I made some last minute changes to the story. I think it's gonna help get Trish on track for the concert. Wait, so you do see that she's being kind of weird? I mean, Trish isn't really doing anything on purpose. She's just got a lot of stuff going on. Chef Jeff is served with hors d'oeuvres. Please do not get on the table again, Sage. I think it oh, jumped on the table last time. these ones with the creamy stuff. I beg your creamy pardon. Joe, we got here just Yo. in time. Fresh snacks. Look, I'm not going to spoil the story, but just we're all in this together. You know, that's what the game's all about. So maybe it'll make the whole band thing feel more, you know? No, I don't. Yeah. I, I don't I know, hope so. but I'm gonna act like I do. Previously on Legends and Lore, our party tracked Kef's cultists, hell-bent on ushering in a cataclysm of apocalyptic proportions to a confrontation that left the dark mage Fae unconscious. 
Hmm? Right to has escaped, this time, okay. intent on summoning Braxis, an ancient god of death and destruction to this world. But Faye is stirring, and their amnesia is subsiding. The Elder Celeste leans in close to Faye on the deck of the Vagrant. That was a nasty spell you took. How's your head? Not great, but I think I'm starting to remember some stuff. Go with it. In the meantime, let me reintroduce the crew. This is Sid, the captain. I'm Sid. <laughs> I'm Sid. <laughs> this is Naomi. I'm Sid, the captain of our fair ship, the Vagrant. Ah, I, I can't do voices for all these niggas. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. I'm gonna try though. Let me, let me see. We gotta dig down into something, bro. Hi, oh, hey, I'm Ollie, <laughs> the troublemaker. I like getting into trouble. That's what you literally just said. I'm the chef. Je I'm the chef. I'm, I'm, I'm Chef Jeff. I like punching and seasoning. I'm Maya, the vine mage. I like plants and stuff. Alright, bro. I ain't got it like that. I ain't got all these types of fucking voices. They're they're tweaking out. Try it. Or is this Naomi? I am. Linnea? I am... I am Linnea. The Angelics. Le Linnea of the Angelics. Honor and sacrifice. I also know knowledge. <laughs> Tell us about yourself, Faye. Oh! Um... I, I didn't know I had to prepare anything. That's okay. Perfectly fine. The Lore Maestro's Guide says it's totally fine to not have a huge backstory already. Maybe we could get some suggestions from the table. Oh, oh, you're the long-lost heiress to a distant kingdom, banished as a child after an unjust coup. <gasps> Maybe you were an astute student until your aspirations turned unorthodox and you began studying the scythe. Or the you scythe. were a traveling musician who signed away your soul for incredible talent with the guitar. Maybe that's how you lost your memories or something. I like Sage's idea. I'm not gonna lie, the musician is kind of stupid. Damn. I'm a Harris, forced from my rightful throne. Tragedy, tragedy. So happy to finally meet you, Faye. Come, everyone. We have much to talk about. I'm not gonna lie, I'm about to just start saying this shit in my normal voice. I do not remember all these voices. Mm. Like Kef? Maya. What? What? It's okay to dream. Maya has a cr has a crush on the enemy. It's not a crush. I just think he's handsome and charismatic. That's a crush. That exactly sounds like a crush to me. I was gonna say that. That is exactly what a crush is. Anyway, we interrogated a cultist a cultist last last session and found out about the ritual they were performing in the crystal caves. Interrogated. You interrogated them? Ethically, using ethical magic? Okay, what the f So, fantasy torture. Ahem. We also learned... <laughs> oh, wait, that's Reed. I just realized that's Reed. We also learned that they may... That they... Hold on. We also learned that there may be answers hidden in an ancient library hidden above the clouds of Mistwoven... Of the Mistwoven... No, of the Mistwoven Archipelago. Now we must choose between that which we know and that which we have yet to learn. We have got to go for the cave cultists. It's the only thing we know from, for sure. Second, seconded for reasons. No way, I vote library. I want to do some research. You just want to see if your book is there. You have a book? What is it called? Punching and seasoning. Garbage. Hey, you need to leave that damn book on the damn shelf. Buddy Aiden. Truly inspirational. <laughs> I agree with Jeff. There's no greater power than knowledge of your foes. Plus, I don't think it's a red herring. Reed wouldn't wouldn't do that to us. No metagaming. What's metagaming? Don't worry about it. It would seem our party is split. Darkwin, what say you? I'm trying to get active. I'm not going to lie. You know, I'm trying to get down in the nitty gritty. Pull up to the dang, the crystal caves. 
I choose the Crystal Caves. I'd rather not dabble in speculation. Let us attack them in their home base. Yeah. I already know. Sweet. Sweet, yeah. Totally. Exactly, bro. We, we getting active, bro. About to roll a D40. What the hell? <laughs> the caves should be right here, but I don't see them. Maybe we should check behind the, the waterfall. Oh, what a pickle we find ourselves in. It's definitely behind the waterfall. It could be anywhere. It's behind the waterfall. Probably the waterfall. Exactly. Probably the waterfall. Should we check the waterfall? Fine. It's in the waterfall. Okay, then what are we waiting for? Let's go fight some cultists. Sid parks the airship nearby while you check behind the waterfall. Indeed, there is a cave there. Deeper inside, you come across a door surrounded by shining crystals. Hmm. Are we going to open the door or what? No, we are. It's just, I don't trust this. What do you mean? There's probably a trick to it or a trap. Well, staring at it isn't going to get us inside. Let's go. <clears> oh, <throat> this fucked up, bro. Let me let me take a swig of this water. This agua, agua. Igualmente. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's like Simon says. This one starts it. Okay, so green, green. It's green, purple, red. I don't remember where it goes after that. Damn. Okay, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Locked in, we peeping it, yeah. door now open, you quietly sneak into the antechamber. Inside, the torchlight of the cultists reflects off the sparkling walls as they gyrate around an enormous crystal that's buzzing with magical energy. As the cultists begin their dramatic crescendo, a hooded figure emerges from behind the crystal. He lowers his hood, and you see the striking figure of Kev, the lead cultist oh my god it's him it's him even from afar kef holds absolute sway over the cult kef raises his hand how seducible how seducible does he look <laughs> seducible <laughs> susceptible to seduces <laughs> susceptible to seduction yeah, could he be seduced by, say, a very beautiful vine mage? Um, he's kind of in the middle of something right now. I mean, could we seduce some info out of him? No. Kef raises his hand. How revealing is his robe? What? Oh, yeah, does it show some scale? <laughs> it's a lovely robe that shows no more scale than is appropriate. He raises... He tortured. How tortured does it seem like his childhood was? He's had some hard times. Okay. He raises <laughs> his head in the crystal of lights. There. He bellows. <laughs> Come, children of Braxis. Let me bring this ritual of honor for the honor of the vile lord of our vile lord. What do you all want to do? They're gonna say seduce him. The sooner we rush in and stop the ritual, the sooner I can com comfort. <laughs> the sooner I can comfort Kef's sensitive inner child. We have to focus and play it cool. Let's sit back and see what we can learn. Babe, what do you instinct? Inst what do your instincts tell you? If we run in now, we're probably going to get our surrounded and beat the f down. Hang back and see what's going on. Peep game. Let's hang back a bit. Wait for our moment. The heroes huddle behind some rocks in wait.
you made the right choice, Faye. Did we notice anything that might act, that might help us? Yes, the dancing cultists and the glowing crystal. With all the dancing, I bet they have a great I bet they have great abs. What about our packs? Excuse me. Anything that might give us an edge? Rope, old rusted bell, explosion oh, explosion potion in this confined space. Yeah, we Uh I have a potion labeled bang. Throw it. I throw it. Bang! There is an explosion of red mist, and then the cultists turn towards you in unison. Did we hit anything? You there! Who dares defile my ritual? Children of the night, protect me! Alright, you're entering combat. It's a little light work, bro. This little bum is about to cut this and get down. Roll for initiative. We got that. Nat 20. Uh, we up on a 13. Let's go. I got a 13. Looks like that's the highest roll. You'll go first. Yes, sir. Let's see. Focused attack, wide sweeping attack. Focus, just one guy. Please. Oh my lord. I hit the bad guy closest to me really, really hard. Eight damage. They look hurt, but they're still standing. Damn. Take that, you creeps. I cast difficult terrain and cover the ground in um slippery whipped cream. Oh. What the f bro? Mid-fight? That's how you get down? Two of the cultists slip and knock themselves out on the hard ground. <laughs> Score. Now I run up and hit another one in the face. Oh, yeah, just hold on. It's not your attack anymore. Hey, that, bro. bro, eager. The cultists are going to attack now? All at once. I should have done a wide sweeping attack. One hits you for three damage. Okay. That's nothing. Next, Maya. Another one casts a spell of confusion on you. Roll to resist. Chief in the fold. 16. My brain is too strong for their weak magic. Brilliant. Finally, Jeff. A whipped cream covered cultist grabs your ankles and knocks you to the floor. You are being grappled. Ew. Maya, Linnea, you both rolled the same initiative. Who wants to go first? Kill a lot of them. I could use, I could try to use my immobilize, I could try to immobilize them with my vine powers. And I could crowd control them with a calm spell, maybe. We could calm them. I think we've done enough damage for now. I start singing an ancient song. It sounds, an ancient song. It sounds like something your mother would have sung to you when you were a baby. The cultist's eyelids grow heavy and their movement slows. Give me a roll to see how well your spell works. Better hit a nat 20. A 13? Okay. One cultist falls asleep where they stand. Another looks totally dazed, but the others manage to shake off your song. That shit was trash. Time for vine violence. I stand with my feet apart and close my eyes, summoning the power of plants. Okay, give me a roll. Dang, a nat 20? Okay. Vines erupt all over the cave floor and tangle around the feet of the remaining cultists. They might as well be wearing cement booties. Come again? Cement who's? The last cultist falls. But the crystal gets exceptionally bright and then explodes. Cap lies on the ground. That nigga bleeding. You're too late. Nothing can stop him now. You, you insignificant fools. You ineffective wastrels. Okay. You soft-shelled babies. You really think you've defeated me? I mean... Foolish children. This nigga just throwing out fucking back hair. Like, this nigga just slapping the shit out of us with these damn... These one-liners, bro. Come on. You are but infants to Braxis. You know nothing of his dark designs. My death will only serve to cement your fate. You're too handsome to die. Please, I'll be your queen. Shit, tripping. You can do that? You can do that? Is that a thing? Nah, I'm just making it up. I don't know. Okay, this is taking long enough. I cast Area of Authenticity. Ah, 
Ah, yes, the area of authenticity. Kef and everyone standing around him are forced to tell the truth. Oh, do you think my friend is hot? She is attractive in a plenty way. <laughs> okay, how long does this spell last? Wait, does that mean all of us have to tell the truth? Oh, yeah, we're all in the spell. Here, I'll prove it. Hey, out of all of us here, who's the coolest? I don't fucking remember names. Uh, Jeff? I think that's, yeah, I'm, I just let me just hand it back. Probably Jeff. I knew it. Def Jeff. Def Chef Jeff. I'm still close to taking it back. And <laughs> I'm close to taking this back. Anyways. Now tell us about this ritual. Long ago, deep within a river of tears, the legendary axe Blightbane was forged. Its metal shone like a thousand suns. Its handle... Hold on. I'm behind on my notes. What was the name of the axe? Blightbane. Blightbane. Brightbane. Nigga, are you deaf? No, with an L. Blight. Blightbane. Gotcha. Its handle glimmered brilliantly. Such a weapon had never existed before and has never existed since. It was brought to the vile chambers of the Temple of Bane, where it was enshrined beside other artifacts capable of destroying the gods. <laughs> Temple of Pain? No! The Temple of Bane! This was enshrined for centuries, walked away until it was stolen. Now it sits in a terrible swamp, poisoning the land. Excuse me. Now, do you spell Bane with an A-N-E or with a... Oh my god. With a Y, with an A-Y-N. It's spelled the normal way. My wounds are too great for this. Braxis, take me. No, wait. What do you think of my hair? That shit is f Alright, nigga. Damn, you selling it, bro. Come on. And thus... Thus, I die. Dude, okay, nigga, you want a Grammy? Like, ah, damn, an Oscar? <clears throat> ah, you guys survey the aftermath of the crystal explosion <laughs> and you get sold readings. that. You feel a small tremor come from the caves. Is there any loot? Hold on. Is there any loot? Oh, yeah. Does Kef have any loot? There's no loot. Damn. I took a lock of his hair. Standard operating procedure. Stalker alert. That's... 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 You know, that seems... Seems about right to me. Mm, that isn't strange at all. You notice a weirdly shaped crystal sticking out of the dirt. Another tremor. I pull on it. You pull out a crystal guitar. Oh, shit. It is gnarly. Oh, sweet. I got a guitar. Can't wait to play it. Oh, it's Brightbane. Mm, yeah, Blight. Uh, mm, <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> That's a different kind of axe. Oh, hey, we found some loot. 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 Get it? Okay. As soon as you take hold of its handle, another tremor shakes the room. This one is bigger. The ceiling shudders and then cracks, and a giant crystal falls and blocks the entrance. Shit. Hold on, hold on. I know, I, I, I know. I have a spell for this. Oh shit. I'll be with you soon, Kef. Kefi, I guess I could use the guitar thing. Use it, use it, use it. What if it doesn't do anything though? Lena, spell time. Trish, guitar it up. Yeah, you better start fucking playing this, bro. Ollie, do something with the guitar. <laughs> ah, I'm just gonna start jamming. Amazing. As you shred, the sound of the guitar grows around you. It resonates against the walls, getting okay, louder hold on. and louder, eventually shattering all the okay. crystals. The path is clear. Damn. Oh my gosh. Encore. Oh hell yeah, magical guitar. Hey Reed, quick question. Do I have a voice coming from the guitar? 
A uh, voice? No. Are you sure? I, I don't hear a voice. Are, are you sure it's not a sentient guitar? No, it's just epically cool. Why do you ask? Because I want to seduce it. Bro, it's a guitar! Cool. You hear the airship droning above you. Here to pick you up. She got a damn power-up, bro. So we're playing a goddamn guitar and shit. Man. Well, it seems you two have... You have, cho you have two choices. We can travel to the ocean of sand in search of long forgotten temple. Where my, my, where we may be lost forever. But it also is the ancient homeland of my people. Sure. sure. Or you can enter the misty mangroves. Filled with vile creatures driven mad by the swamp. Where we might find a badass weapon. And that's where we'll end our session tonight. Okay, shit was just getting fired. So, that was L and L. What do you think, Fang? That shit was gas. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm not gonna lie. That shit was gas. Bro, that shit was gas. I now have exactly one nerd interest. We'll make a dork out of you yet. <laughs> More flowing tabletop gamer energy into you as we speak. I can feel it. Well, time to feed the wormy. That was epic. Super epic. Do you think it worked? Hard to say. Right. I guess we'll see. Well. What did what was supposed to work? I can tell this is important to you. Thanks again. That was really cool. And now I know what you're thinking about between all of your drum solos. Hey there. We're gonna be texting, okay. Hey, sorry I bailed so quick. Rosa drove me, so. Anyways, I just wanted to say, thanks for helping me with Mango today. That's what best friends are for. My laundry smells like slime trash. I could, I could, I could, I could cook you, but you know, that's what, that's what we're here for, bro. You know, day ones. I'm always here to help. We're best buds. Right? But I'm glad she's okay. I know I'm like all about bug stuff right now, but it's just really exciting to me. It feels like I'm onto something. You know? I don't know, but go off. It's something me. Yeah. I know the feeling. But we're still gonna play, we're still totally gonna win Battle of the Band. Swamp Babies? Psh. Back to the bog with ye head ass. <laughs> Back to the bog. I'm glad we get to do this together. I'm glad we got to do this together. Uh, duh. And now you're in our adventuring party. I gotta go hold on for dear life. Rose is an extremely scary driver. Well, I'll see you around. I mean, probably. And, uh, most likely. Hopefully. 80%. Hell no. A cool 60? Yeah, they said Rosa can't get drive for shit. JJ, JK, JK, 100. Mm hmm. Mm hmm You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, nigga, read back the fuck up, bro. All of my damn phone. <laughs>